We would like to welcome you in QLE course. Today we will speak about uh, the module two. We will focus on module two, how to connect quality assurance with the outside world. If you have any question, you can ask us later in the, after the presentation. In this model, we would like to inform you how to connect the quality assurance with the world outside the institution. This presentation will navigate you how to communicate with staff, students and external stakeholders about quality culture. So here as a leader, we have two key competencies. First, be aware that the quality of education is closely correlated with its responsiveness to the world of work and broader societal goals. The second, be able to relate that it the, the institutional quality purposes to new developments in the relevant professional fields and in the region and wider society. So the message is, quality assurance must be must track on the outside world. Therefore, listening is the key competencies. So, firstly, we can look on students and graduates' needs for their being successful in the outside world. Students are also co-creators of their own learning. Therefore, student-centered learning is not just a pedagogical concept, but also an integral part of quality culture. The future graduates need to develop not just professional field competencies, but also the rich set of social competencies. For example, including responsibility for future, entrepreneurial competencies, critical sensing, thinking, and etc. Graduates' reflection as indicator of acquired competencies to be successful in their lives and jobs. Second important uh, area is also responsibility for region. Especially professional higher education institutions are the key player for the development of regions. Considering in your quality assurance systems how you respond to the regional needs and opportunities. Try to ask questions. How do you involve regional stakeholders and their needs to your quality assurance systems? Are they satisfied with your work? And do not forget on non-commercial and civic sector too. The third area is also the international and national context. So as a leader, you need to take into account international and national context. So ideally, external quality assurance mechanism should provide you supportive and valuable feedback about your internal quality assurance systems. However, this doesn't always happen. In this case, dialogue with national authorities is necessary. Also, membership in the different international or national association can help communicate your needs. Consider also in your quality assurance system the role of international experts, which can bring you view from different perspectives. And this is the key things which you need to mem memorize for have a successful connection, your quality assurance with outside world. Thank you very much for attention.